film doesn't lie. And when you flip on Jeremiah Smith's tape, you'll see why he is the truth. Smith, who's from Miami, Florida, plays at Shamadan Madonna High School and is committed to Ohio State. He's the number one recruit in the country, the number one wide receiver in the country, the number one player in the state of Florida. He's all the number ones. And when you turn on his tape, he shows you over and over and over why he deserves that ranking. But how good is Jeremiah Smith from a historical perspective? How does he compare to some of the legends as they were coming out of high school? That's exactly what I want to know. So let's bring on director of scouting and ranking, Charles Power, to put Jeremiah Smith's ability into perspective. Five-star Ohio State commit Jeremiah Smith showed why he is the top receiver in the 2024 cycle and one of the top overall prospects recently just having a monster game against Bergen Catholic in New Jersey. Jeremiah Smith had 16 catches for 316 yards and three touchdowns in just three quarters, was pulled out of the game. And this is against one of the best high school programs in the state of New Jersey, one of the best teams in New Jersey. Jeremiah Smith just had the, the full package of skills on display. He has elite burst and movement skills at his size. To be honest, it looked like the film was in fast forward at times just with how fast he was moving, but it, that's not the case. It was, this is legitimate play speed film that we're, that we're watching here. Uh, he's at 6'3", 200 pounds, has a full route tree. Like I said, exceptional movement skills, can sink his hips, strong hands, uh, toughness and speed after the catch. Just a phenomenal, phenomenal showing. And really, uh, as good as you'll see from, from the high school level with a high volume target uh, for a five-star prospect. So how good is Jeremiah Smith? I think you have to go back, back a ways. I, I'm not sure we've seen this combination of size, speed, skills, and, and just overall technical ability uh, come out of South Florida in a very long time. Uh, I closely covered and, and got to see uh, Amari Cooper, Calvin Ridley, Jerry Judy, those, t those types of guys, five-star prospects, first-round picks in person in high school. And I'm not sure they had the overall just skill package and physical ability that we've seen from Jeremiah Smith. I think you have to go back a really far, a really far ways. Now, to me, the gold standard at the receiver position in the internet recruiting era is the class of 2008. It's Julio Jones, AJ Green. I think those guys were as good as I've ever seen. Um, I actually got to see AJ Green in person in high school and they were unbelievable. Jeremiah Smith could be in that category. This is an ongoing evaluation. We still have a lot of his senior season left to play. We're gonna see him in person, hopefully at a national all-star game, but he could be that good. This is a guy who could potentially challenge for the number one prospect in the nation, regardless of position. He is a, an elite, game-changing type of prospect at receiver, and I think he is a instant like impact freshman freshman All-American type, three and out, first round pick. He has that ability and a, a very high ceiling, but also a very high floor, a guy we just feel great about. Thank you for watching. If you enjoyed that content, be sure to subscribe to the On3 Recruits channel. We have a new page dedicated only to recruiting. Go ahead and hit that subscribe button right now.